I think well been watching Facebook for a couple of days seen a lot of people up in the mornings camping watching the sunrises and the sunsets and I finally broke I had to come out so I've set off late I think it's about half six quarter to seven so hopefully the, the public will die down by now just plan on uh, stopping in Corn Mountain uh, where I tried to attempt last time I was up here but I failed so it's about 19 degrees really nice day I'm just gonna keep away from everyone social distance uh, I can technically see I'm fishing fishing for sunrises and fish, fishing for sunsets <laughs> Aye, so I'm using the helm too tonight because there's two uh, uh, I've got the sky high 700 hub kit sleeping bag an MSR pocket rocket 2 stove to cook on. I'm just gonna have a boil in the bag. Maybe it's a little bit of wine. Hopefully get a sunset. Uh bring the drone as well, so it's adding a bit of more weight onto my bag. Not too much, like I've done worse. Uh, and the last time I was up here I must have uh, left my poles outside the car. Can't find them anywhere. <laughs> so the only cheap ones like I will be looking for some new ones so if anyone watches this want to send us a message on some tips ideas which ones to get that'd be great ones with a tracking device on them <laughs> Aye, so I thought it was a good idea to sit in the sun all day in the garden yesterday I'm paying for it now shoulders are burnt to bits and this bag's just ripping the shoulders to shreds but it's always going to happen especially to me <laughs> Aye, so there's not much wind at the minute the forecast was, was about 25 mile an hour gusts at the, uh, on the summit which is, isn't too bad so hopefully it just stays like this I can maybe get some shots on my drone if not well I'll just try and get a time lapse on the GoPro and some stuff like that but I'm just ha happy to be out buzzing um, a lot of people may think it's frowned upon but as long as I'm staying away from everyone I'll be alright Set up late, pack up early, I'm not bothering anyone. I think that's the best medicine for anyone. Uh, so it's a little bit windy. Don't think I want a chance getting the drone out unless it dies down a little bit. 
like I say, it's that Mavic Mini. It's only a little thing. I think it's limited to like something like 20 mile an hour winds. Well, I don't want to spend my whole time here I'm looking for a drone. <laughs> so, if they die down, I'll use it. But you can kind of see on this, we're coming up to these tiles here. And I'm going to come up here, up to Cod Mountain. Uh, looks like a good spot. There's a few bits of the wall you can shelter from if we need to, so aye. And it's it's not too high either. Yeah. About an hour, an hour and a half, I don't know. Taking your time. So I'm not doing anything stupid. Not taking any risks. Had a quick look around. Um, I think this will do nicely just here. It looks like the flattest part. Uh, got that as a nice little view, so spot on. And lucky for me, there's a nice seat there for watching the sunset and the sunrise. So let's get the tent up. Right, that's me up. The helm too. Class little view. Look at that. Great. So, a little bit windy. It's supposed to die down in about an hour. I'll just take a quick run through some of my stuff. So, look here. There's a book. Handy little bit of kit, that's great. So, this is my sleeping bag. Alp kits, Sky High 700s. And then I'm using the OEX. Uh, sleep mat, just a summer one, and a uh, trek I'll hike, hike adventure up to Lourdes, just went flat. Um, new little light there, little Amazon lights, rechargeable. I've been looking all over there for my GoPro batteries, thought I lost them. Biggest rookie mistake in the world, I thought never. But 20 minutes I've been looking, and it was sitting underneath my GoPro, so I found them anyway, but... Ah, look at this. Makes it all worth it, eh? Yeah. You know, could be in Tesco's crowded people or anywhere in them parks and the beaches you see on the uh, TV where they're all crammed together, you know. Not a soul in sight here. So, I know it might be frowned upon, but you know what I mean? You can't, I'm not doing anything wrong, not not whatsoever here. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant. Just ready for that to come down. And I think it'll look absolutely great. I want this, the, uh, the winds to die down and maybe get the GoPro, uh, sorry, the drone out. Just get, get a little fly around. I think that'll just be a perfect touch. So, hi, gonna have some wine and enjoy it. Okay, so this is my setup for tonight. See the summit cup? These have all seen them. Fold away pretty nice. And this is my new pot for boiling. It's a Tom Shoe pot. Uh, looks exactly the same as that Torsk one. It's a 750ml. I think the only difference with this one is the lid stays on. Look, I heard a lot of reviews saying there that the Torsk one or whatever it's called. It's quite loose, the, the lid on it, so that's my pot. It actually comes with a hanger as well. Um, so if you were doing any bushcraft or fires or something like that, you could hang it on a, on a uh, stick and cook like that, you know, but ideal. £20 it was from a company in, on eBay, obviously Chinese, but for the same price, uh, £35 for the Torsk, and this one's £20. Do you know what I mean? It's great for that price you know so yeah and this is my new 
stove, the MSR Popper Rocket 2. You have all seen this. Um, seen a lot of reviews. I was either going to get the jet boil or this, but I think with this, I like the fact of I've got a stove. When I'm camping, it just makes it feel more like like I'm camping. If you, does that make any sense to anyone? I like to boil and watch the flames and stuff like that. You know, so this is perfect. Really good quality. I think it's about twenty five to thirty pound. You can get them from Amazon. Uh, it's 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 all I need. That for that. That's a big gas stand. Yeah, that's it. Jobs are good. Boil the bag. All right, just waiting for me food. So just gonna chill out, enjoy the rest of the night. Um. Unless something happens, uh, I'll see you in the morning. Hopefully we'll get a nice sunrise. Maybe just get the drone out, get a look around before I head home. But yeah, it's been really good. Sort the head right out. This is what I need, you know. It's what everyone needs. You know, you can always come in the morning to get your head sorted. So, yep. Unless something happens, I'll see you in the morning. Morning. Uh, didn't get any sleep really. Pillow went down through the night, so I've been shuffling about and stuff like that. Sleeping bag is really warm. But aye. Uh, so I'm gonna put a cup of on, but even though I got didn't get any sleep, it doesn't matter, it's still worth it. I'm gonna catch that. Right, that's me, all packed up, leave no trace, um, it's pretty early still so we've beat all the traffic and stuff like that, you know, um, there's no one around, leave before anyone turns up, so yep, cheers for watching, um, in the next few weeks I'll be doing some more so if you could stick a sub on for us that'd be great, okay, cheers.
like me for you Tomorrow comes with one desire To take me away, oh Stop to cry, cause girl, you know I got to.